Hello there folks, this is Dan Brown from sortofinteresting.com and today we're going to take a look at the Celestron Travelscope 70. Now, I've been using this telescope for a good few weeks now and I've got to say I am very impressed. I was very much interested in getting a very cheap and very portable telescope and this absolutely fits the bill perfectly. I picked it up on Amazon for around £60, which as I'm sure you're aware is certainly on the low end of how much telescopes can cost. Um, it is also exceptionally portable, as you can see, the tripods, eyepieces and telescope all come with a backpack that all fits in, and together the whole package weighs less than 2 kilograms, which is in fact less than my pair of Celestron binoculars. So then, what do you get? Well, obviously you get the telescope, which is fantastic quality. It has to be said, I am very impressed with this, especially at the price point. You get two eyepieces, a 20 and 10 millimeter, which with this telescope give you a magnification of 20 and 40 times. Um, you also obviously get the tripod, which is the only real letdown of this package, as it is exceptionally flimsy. And you also get the backpack, so all of your equipment can be stuck in there and taken off out to a hill or wherever you're going to go astronomizing. Um, I've got to say, all in all, this is a fantastic thing. Except for the tripod, everything seems to be really good quality. Um, to give you a bit of perspective on the sort of things you can see, uh, just through my bedroom window without even leaving the house, and this is by a streetlight as well, with the 40 times magnification, I was able to look at Jupiter and see the lines of cloud in the atmosphere. Which, when you're dealing with a telescope that's so relatively low priced and just generally so portable, I've got to say, I think is very impressive indeed. Uh, like I say, the only real negative to this whole package is the tripod. But the telescope does come with a standard tripod connector, so you can switch the tripod to another one that you've already got, or if needs be, you can have a look and invest in a better quality one. All in all, this is definitely something that I give a big damn brown and sort of interesting thumbs up to. I would definitely recommend it to any beginner out there, just because of its relatively low cost. And certainly if you're looking for something to just take out randomly, or even just set up and look through your window, this is definitely worth a look, and like I say, I've seen excellent detail on Jupiter for the price and the general size. Um, for more information, check out the link in the description for my written review. Uh, check out sortofinteresting.com, and in general, have a good day.